Okay, so we'll be trying to finish up Wi-Fi Subway here. Here's the Wi-Fi line. Current rank is 9. So just one more rank to go. Here's the team Shadow in the wild card slot. We're using Shadow, Nonstick, Charythmia. Let's go for train number one. Okay, 13266. There's no data for that train. Which means we have to go way back and re enter everything. Save the game again, select a team again. It's not like when you challenge a train within 24 hours of losing. Where you can just pick a new train without going through all that nonsense again. As I was saying. Let's try train number 11 this time. Maybe 911. That'll be a popular enough choice that people want to pick it and populate it with data. Guess not. Okay, keep going. Let's try train number 21. Woohoo, it actually has some data to it. That's not an event, that's a Levile. And you probably outspeed Shadow, which means there's no point trying to stay in here. Switch to non-stick. Night Slash. No need to... You're almost certainly Sash anyway. There's Ice Punch. No Freeze. Okay. I guess you just naturally landed on 1 HP without a Sash, which is good because I want to get the KO with Bolt Switch anyway. Get back to Shadow. Gallade. Shadow Ball. Sucker Cut, of course. Now, Gallade can get Sucker Punch, right? Let's see if it has that. Okay, so it has a priority move and a non priority move. It'll prefer the non priority move. 
Well, I prefer the priority move, but it went for Psycho Cut again, so... I guess you don't have Shadow Sneak, and I can finish it off. And Polion with an Air Balloon. Now here I have to scout for Aqua Jet. This time you do have the Aqua Jet, which means I would not be able to get Destiny Bond up in time. But I don't think you can hurt Charythmia at all, so here we go. Seven damage. Yeah. Surf for 21. That's the best you can do. We'll just set up all the way. Just in case. That's surf number 14. Not the air balloon, who cares? Surf 16. Wait, what? You're hiding grass knot in the back and you prefer to run out all your surfs first? Whatever. Game over. Imposter. Hmm. That's a that's a Landorus T. Now the good thing about Landorus, if it has earthquake or explosion, those moves do nothing. I would take a U-turn, but I highly doubt it'll ever pick U-turn unless all of its alternatives are in the same do-nothing category. Just see how much. That's a scarf landorus. So I'm too slow to get the destiny bond. The good thing is you're locked into a non-stab outrage. So I think I can get this setup down. What I want to do here is protect. If this is a two-turn outrage, you'll get confused immediately. If it's a three-turn outrage, the timer will reset without you getting confused at all. Got the confusion. So perhaps the switch is a bit safer. You hit yourself, so it's a free switch. Sub up. Ooh, right at 50, that's not good. Keep going. Snap out of confusion. Sub up, because I know this is going to break. Previous hit dealt just short of 50. Okay, that works. Finish yourself with confusion damage. And then at plus three. Lapras. Let's see what you... Thunder. There's no way Thunder pierces the sub at plus four. 
Yep, that holds. Go to six. So that's six thunders down. Are you water absorber? I couldn't afford to waste a turn to find out here. Yes, you are, which means I have no choice but to stall you all the way to struggle. Under eight. Sub fades, fine. Under ten. Next question is, do you have PP-ups on that thunder? Sheer cold, wow. I was gonna go for rest, but with sh as long as you have sheer cold PP, I can't risk that. Could get a hit, then another hit while I'm snoozing. Ice shard, huh? Ice beam. So as long as they don't fall into the sheer cold trap, you're harmless. I can afford to waste at least one more scald. Sheer cold four. Sheer cold six. Now you have at most one more sheer cold, so I can afford to rest here. Do I even want to put subs up anymore? You're already out of sheer cold. Your PP maxed on that. You've used eight. Well, I guess the neat thing, neat thing about Ice Shard, even if it does less damage than Leftovers recovers, Ice Shard means you're moving first, which means I get to use that as an excuse to go to sleep before the Leftovers can heal the damage. And waste two more turns that way. It's just a matter of time before you run out of moves and have to go to struggle. Every three turns you're using six PP, I'm using one. There's struggle. Eight. Still in the green, so you're 4N plus 1. It'll take 5 struggles. So now. And struggle. Scizor. This should be easy. I'm probably gonna go for Swords Dance, but you never get the chance. Pursuit Assurance. Yeah, right. Celia. 
Hmm. I should be able to two hit it with Shadow Ball. Maybe not. An icy Wind. That's an Icy Wind Cresselia. First off, am I still faster? I might want to go for Icy Wind again. This nonstick should be. Yeah, nonstick's only 83 speed. This should discourage an Icy Wind. Psychic, okay. I still want to go for Psychic, then. Let's go Bolt Switch. Get Charythmia in safely. Can I sub up? Okay, so you're still faster. Plus side, that at least means you're not going to go for Icy Wind. Three. Four. Critical, okay, so the sub fades early. Hidden What is that hidden power for? It's not fire. It's not ice. Do I risk going for rest? Might as well. Mm. I'm gonna keep going for hidden power instead of icy wind, that's good. Realm. Substitute. Okay. And there's the Toxic Orb, your Poison Heal. Fair enough. But you're going for Substitute. And now you're spamming Spore against a sub because you don't know how sub works in this game. Barely hangs on and gets poison heal. Another spore. That works, I'll take it. Chansey. As long as you can get a burn to stick on you, you're golden. Minimize, so that's on a timer. And I just hit through Minimize and get the three hit KO. Wasn't expecting that, but that'll work too. Latios. 
And I have seen a couple Latios that were Trick Scarf. Let's see if that's what you're up to. Shadow would beat a Trick Scarf Latios anyway, but would end up locked into Shadow Ball Lap. Okay, Draco Meteor, that's fine. Special Defense Bell, see if I care. Special Attack Bell, see if I care. This could be a speed tie. The question is, is that low enough on health that I can finish it off with Sucker Punch? I'm not sure. It's over 20%. Let's go for it here. Good. Went first. Volcarona. I think I have to pop the Destiny Bond here. We left with 2 on 1 against an unknown backline. There is some stuff that can beat me in the third slot, possibly Vera Zion. Let's hope, let's hope I can handle whatever it is. Send out nonstick first just in case it is something like that. I can abuse Sturdy to get an extra hit in. Cloister. Okay, so I probably get two Volt Switches plus some number of Scalds. That has to be enough. You're not even Sash, okay. Whatever. <laughs> On to number five. Out on. Okay, probably a sand team, which means I could be on a timer. Let's see how much Shadow Ball does. Red card. Non stick. Red card stealth. I think I know what you're up to here. And I'm gonna use Volt Switch because I want to sack off nonstick and shadow. Switch to Shadow here. This will be another Earthquake. Stealth Rock will finish this off. I'm pretty sure this set has Roar. Yawn. Okay, then. So I've seen Stealth Rock, I've seen Earthquake, I've seen Yawn. I haven't seen Roar, but I strongly suspect that's the fourth move. If I can get Shadow put to sleep. Let's go for Sucker Punch here. Yawn, good. Now, if you go for Yawn again, because Protect does not block Roar, do I need to last Protect? Eh. Wait, Protect? What? Protect still blocks Roar here? Okay. And I'm asleep. Which means you don't want to go for Yawn, because I'm already asleep. You don't want to go for Stealth Rock, that's already up. You don't want to go for Earthquake, because you can probably see Levitate, even though it hasn't been popped up yet.
So now Charisma takes rocks, Shadow takes rocks, and sand. And Shadow will go down first. One more. One twenty seven. If Shadow were awake here, I could go for protect. But as it is, I have to go through another round of this roar switch. Only 77 HP, but now you can't roar me out. Get the sub up. Guard against Critical Earthquake. And guard against Yawn, incidentally. That works too. Rest now. There's Critical Earthquake. There's Critical Earthquake. Fifty-one sixty-three. That means I can still safely put up a sub. Sand happens before leftover, so thirteen sand to one. Now I just run you out of earthquakes. Looks like you're already out because you're using Stealth Rock again. And Roar fails because I sacked off both the team members. They I a stinker. Four, five, six, and now we're ready. Latios. You probably survive a scald. And your trick scarf. Bit late for that now. Burn doesn't matter. We're locked into trick. Not sure what the point of a trick scarf Latios backline on a sand team is. Of course, that means you can make a PP stall switch since you're locked into a non-damaging move. Sash. Earthquake. But since you gave me the free hit on the switch, that's all you get.
Okay, so you're not choice Garth, you're choice Specs. <laughs> That's fine. Five battles and I haven't been through any Hackmons so far. That's good. If they're really well built Hackmons, they're probably going to be near the end anyway. Because who's going to want a team, want to design a team that can try and take them out while well, still getting through the normal teams in the front? Okay, nine two. Could find, probably want to scout what this has. Could have crunch. Could be a special set. Flare Blitz. Huh. I think the play here is to go straight to Charythmia without dealing any damage because I don't want it to wear itself down with Flare Blitz recoil. Air Blitz for 35. Sub will hold against that. Close combat. Another close combat. Sub. Wait, what? Sunny day. First Flare Blitz out of Sun dealt 35, so that would be pushed up to about 52. enough to survive a critical flare blitz then. Do I have to rest now? I'll sub now. Okay, the sub held against that. There's the critical flare blitz. Sun fades after this turn unless you're Heat Rock. Sun fades, good. Close combat breaks. Now I have to rest. Forty-nine, okay. Rest again. Extreme speed, so Flare Blitz, Sunny Day, Close Combat, Extreme Speed. That's all your moves.
day, does that still matter? Yep, you still have flare blitzes left. There's struggle. Cresselia. Wait, I'm only at plus five. Get one more. You're calm, mind. Now the sun fades and it can attack. There's the burn. Psychic. Faded. have a healing move or else you would have used it there. Gengar. Now, Gengars in Wi-Fi Subway are almost always Sash, however they're also almost always Leads. Eh. Shadow Ball does whatever. Sash, no burn. We're probably going to go for Destiny Bond here. Yep. Wait a minute. I can go to Shadow and get this KO with Sucker Punch. Sucker Punch, KO. Just one more battle to go. Imposter! So there's the Hackmons! The good thing about this is I know what they have and I know that PP ups don't count when you have an Imposter. You have 5 PP of all these moves, that's it. I'll waste a Shadow Ball with Protect. I think I would rather leave non-stick intact at full health in case I needed to deal with something like a huge power slacking, so I go straight to Charisma here. In the normal subway, you have to worry about reasonable things they might have, but when you're dealing with teams like this, you have to start to consider what kind of unreasonable things they might have. That dealt 72 down to 130. So a critical here is not safe. Wait, if you only have two Shadow Balls left, Nostic can safely dispel them. And has time to get back to full health anyway. Sucker Punch. I'll go for rest.
one more round of healing up to 154, so now I can take a critical shadow ball. But I need non-stick to get back to full health here. Leftovers. Okay, you're out of Shadow Ball. Special Drop doesn't matter because you have no PP left on Special Moves. One. Two. Nonstick is full health and awake. And whatever PP you have left. It's just a matter of time. It. Time to struggle. Oh, hey, Spirit Tomb, no points for guessing what the ability on this thing is. Just to reveal it to our audience at home, we've got, turn to, we've got time to waste a turn. There it is, Wonder Guard, woohoo. Fusion Bolt, okay then. I guess it made sense to them to put Fusion Bolt on this thing. All you can do is keep breaking these subs. That's Fusion Bolt 4. 6. Do you have 8? Yes, you do. Shadow Force, okay. Or steals 58. Huh. Sacred Sacred Fire, what? Or something with a Wonder Guard Spear to me. You sure don't care about longevity by having to move the Lana PP. That's Sacred Fire 4. Sacred Fire 6. Sacred Fire 8. You're all out of that. But still have a couple Shadow Forces left. Along with possibly one other move. Yeah, I'll rest here. Might as well burn some turns. Shock and Shadow Force, why?
I'll just let you hit me with this last free shock. Got your last PP. And you get the paralyzed, see if I care. Okay, one more to go. Sableye, how original! What, you thought I might be able to deal with one Wonder Guard Dark Ghost, but there's no way I'll be able to get through two? First off, sub up first. Protect. Next, let's make sure this thing really does have Wonder Guard. Because these skulls are entirely worthless, might as well run through all them. We have Protect and Will O Wisp. HP missing, last chance to rest. Wait a minute. Bring in nonstick. Suck sucker punch. Huh? want to get burned here, so now... I can abuse black-white sleep mechanics. Burn two sleep turns. Now go back to Kurithmia, and I can burn two more sleep turns. And I only have to switch one-third as often. I'm never burning any PP in the process. Protect Will-O-Wisp Sucker Punch. Fourth move is probably something like Rest. Doesn't matter at this point, you're gone. It's just a matter of time.
Okay, so it's recover, not rest. 14 more turns of this. Here we go. I know you can beat this guy in your sleep. Two more turns. One more turn. And the finishing move, rest. Nice double wonder guard you got there. Do I want to sit? Sure, why not? Hey, blast. Ten BP. Wow. And a promotion to rank 10. Sure. I think these passers by ever give away free items on the Wi-Fi track, they just give whatever their victory message is, but might as well check them out. Yep, and they're pretty much all the default. Everyone big packs, what? <laughs> So, right, no, that's not it. Right, successive records, I think that's what I want. That was against 921. Nine 
2021 on the performance monitor just outside. So now if anyone else wants to try this challenge, they'll face the last six teams there. And then they'll face my team at the end. That's the guy with the double wonder guards. I have no trouble dealing with wonder guard. Because that's how it works. Cool. Okay, that's it.